Hi, today we're talking about the T4 thermal vision optics. The T4 642 Pro version with LRF and the T4 645 Hunter version are the thermal vision scopes that are to be used for monitoring, observing and shooting at the mid and long distances with an opportunity of see a thermal object. Both versions of the scopes are made from a modern shockproof materials which make them lightweight and compact and afford its implementation during their harsh climate conditions both low ones, high ones, hot, wet, dry, etc. Both of them have some ports for the charging modes of CR123 type batteries, two of them, which will afford the operation of both optics for four hours and an additional slot for 18,645 type batteries in here, which will afford its operation for 10 hours in a row. So basically, 14 hours with two types of batteries in here will afford us to use the thermoscopes. What are the differences? The T4 642 Pro LRF is being by the law enforcement basically to be to have an observation, monitoring, and to be able to shoot at the mid and long distances with the thermal vision and to have the integrated rangefinder in it to check the distances for the objects and to automatically insert the ballistic corrections into the scope. A pro version basically differs with the fact that it has a more sensible sensor which affords us a better image than the Hunter one. But the Hunter also has an automatic system of ballistic corrections which doesn't differ from the pro version actually that much. It has a seven types of ballistic grips which can be observed on the screen and both scopes have an opportunity for your own ballistic grip to be created depending on the cartridges, caliber being used and the weapon which is being used. The difference in the name reason of 642 and 645, basically those are the matrices. The seven micron matrix for the 642 and the 12 micron matrix for the T4645 version. As we've already mentioned in the previous videos, the manufacturer is going to change all the matrices to 12 microns by the end of 2023, making the picture even better, more contrast, making the size of the scope smaller and more compact and more lightweight. Not losing any characteristics though, making them only better. Both scopes are known for a Pioneer software of 5.1 version including an inbuilt accelerometer, 24 ballistic tape, a Bluetooth channel for a fast and convenient settings, and a database with saved ballistic grip settings for each separate weapon. Both scopes have 3.5 optical magnification and 2, 4 and 8 times digital zoom. And same as Nivesta S from the video we mentioned above, they are being turned on only for 3 seconds, enabling us to have an accurate shooting in any weather and time conditions during the day and during the night and during the hot and the cold weather. The T4 thermal vision scopes are the last generation made by the manufacturer. The T4 642 version Pro and LRF means that it is made on 17 micron matrix. It is a pro version for the law enforcement and special forces with an inbuilt rangefinder, which is an LRF. While the Hunter, the T4645 version is a 12 micron, a new generation matrix, but the same T4 generation thermal scope, but the Hunter version, which is targeted on more sports and hunting tasks, but still has a very good quality resolution and image, the thermal image. Both scopes can be used for shooting and monitoring of the surrounding areas 
at the middle and long range distances for four hours if we're using the CR123 batteries or the 18645 batteries will ensure us a 10 hours operational time. That's it for now. Thanks for your attention. See you at the next video.